Greetings and salutations, everyone, and welcome to Let's Play Grey, a total conversion for Half-Life 2. I'm Cam Jack Fisco. Come join me for an adventure in creepiness and friggin' horror! So, yeah, let's get started, shall we? First off, let's get ourselves a skill lo What? I can't see my mouse. I can't see my own mouse. You guys can see it, but I can't see it. That's freaky. We'll start on normal. A cold sweat forming on my brow. My unconscious mind began forming an unfathomable nightmare. Plunging down into the depths, I fell. Oh, there's my mouse. Press any key to continue. Mm hmm. So we're waking up in bed. Now we're sitting on our bed. And I guess we're up. Wow, this is dark. I'm gonna have to turn up the brightness for you guys. Okay. Let's see. Now that's actually kinda low. I need to turn the mouse sensitivity up. Let's try, say what, six? Maybe six will work. Let's see how ridiculous six is. Almost good enough, we'll go with that. What the... Okay. Whatever the hell that shit... Hello? It's never good to walk into a room with hooks and photos of dead people on the wall and lots of very creepy doll heads. You ever get that sense like you shouldn't be somewhere? Yeah. I got the... Hello. The fuck are you? I'm gonna go now. Uh. Whoa. Okay. I've only played this once, and that was a long time ago, so I don't remember a lot. Duh. What have you done? You done? I didn't do anything! I'm in this. I swear. God, this is creepy. I was not expecting it to be creepy right off the bat. Hi. You're just like, just like you. I'm not like anybody. I'm like me. Home. I. Hello. What the? F Can I help you? You, you, you got a slight twitchy problem there. I'm, I'm gonna go now. The hell was that? What the? Thought I saw something back there. Hi. What the hell are you? going on here? We're playing another crazy person, aren't we? This is like a cry of fear thing going on. I just know it. This one? I'm confused. Um, I don't. Oh, I see. The hell? Hi. Uh, yeah, look at the time. I gotta go. Bye! I have no sprint key. The freaking Talk about... Oh, that's creepy. That is really freaking creepy. Talk about being dropped right into the shit! Right into the shit, is what I was trying to say. My head was pounding. My hands worked automatically, scrubbing themselves again and again. Slowly, the thunderstorm within my head began to recede. The bar was quiet, silent even. Had they closed while I was been, while I'd been in the bathroom? I'd lost track of time. I needed to find out where everyone had so suddenly gone. Get back to normality. 
Hey, you can say we left normality behind, bro. Just saying. Okay, so there's at least two other people here besides us. Hello! Well, isn't that creepy? I found one of any of these dolls. Why do I not want to collect those? Well, they're not standing outside the bathroom anymore. Hello? Okay. Error messages. That's that's lovely. Well, I don't know what texture and model is supposed to be there, but for whatever. Where is everyone? Fine. Did they close up? It's a damn good question. Wait, is it just me or does that sound like the guy who played Simon? I just finished playing Cry of Fear, and I'm pretty damn sure that sounds very much like Simon. I could be wrong, but that sounds like the same guy playing the voice. Maintenance. Hello? Anybody here? Hello? Hello? There's an error in the corner. Okay. So, about that. Freezer. Oh, this is disgusting. I'm never eating here again. This doesn't exactly look like a fine eating establishment to begin with, there, uh, buddy. Wait, why did my vision just suddenly go blurry for half a second? What the hell is that? Well, there's the exit. Are we allowed to leave? The back door is locked. Maybe the keys are in the office. Of course it's locked. It's a horror game. What am I thinking? Oh, it should ever be quick. Or safe. Okay. Lock is jammed. Hello? Well, here's the office. It's locked on the other side. Here's the key. Why did the door shut when I picked up the key? That seems a little coincidental. Sorry about the jump, guys. I actually had to go back and fix the video, so... Or not the video, the, the mod. Because it was broken with the new update to Steam. So as you can see, the errors aren't there anymore. So, yeah. Because I came outside and there was errors galore. And now there's bushes... I feel like I should go to the repair shop. There might be someone there who can help me. I hate it, but... The service tunnel under the house is the shortest way there. Comforting. So anyway, I fixed my copy of the game, so we shouldn't have any more issues. Just pure creepiness. So yay. Lock is jammed. It's locked, I can't open it. Well, at least it's like Cry of Fear where they actually, you know, have some kind of interaction letting you know it's locked or you don't go here, stupid. So if that's helpful. It's locked, I can't open it. What do we have over here? Oh yeah, I trust this. Boss sent me here to get some replacement drill bits once. Did he now? What the hell? Okay, I guess we need some bolt cutters. Excellent. A bolt cutter. Not sure what for, but I guess at some point it'll become apparent. In the meantime, we carry on. Nothing creepy about this at all. That's fine. Just fabulous. 
Oh, wait, 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 wait. That was an actual transition, but I walked away from it, so it didn't actually trigger. There we go. I just wanted to make sure I searched that last room. The note on the floor made me stop dead. It seemed so innocuous, but somehow I knew it was meant for me. It had been placed here, waiting for my apparently inevitable arrival. The letter gave me o gave only one clue. The address at Block 12. Still, the curse of handwriting seemed hauntingly familiar. Familiar how? Like... Someone we know, or like us? Oh, yeah, it is. this building brings me all kinds of warm fuzzies. What the fuck? I don't think I like this building. Oh, a flashlight! Oh, I hope this flashlight has batteries. We can see! Oh, great. I love this. Flickering flashlight. Lovely. Batteries, which implies this has a limited charge, so we don't want to use it a lot. Okay. So we want to use the flashlight sparingly. Got it. Only when we're trying to see things. Alright, somebody had a lovely accident. What the hell? Oh, this ain't a creepy playground at all. Jeez. Locked. Obviously, we go in there, though. Oh, man. It's locked from the other side. Lock is jammed. Last year, when I got out of the halfway house, the streets were much cleaner. Sounds like things have gone downhill. Locked, locked, so we must go this way. First aid. Well, at least we don't need it yet. That's a positive thing, right? Drinking fountain. Okay. This is not spooky at all. Helps if I don't bash myself in the head with the door. Storage with nothing of consequence in it. Wait a minute, one of the load screens said break boxes. With what? We don't have anything to break them with. Obviously we want to come back and break these once we can. Lovely hallway. Hello? Hello? Lock is jammed. What the? Is there something above us? Fuck. A note and a key. What the hell? Is this the note he was talking about of the load screen? Through block what twelve. What the hell? Through block twelve? Who's fucked up enough to leave bloody notes all over the place? I don't know, man. But sadly. That's going to have to wait for the next episode. So, uh, thank you everybody for watching. This isn't creepy at all or anything. You guys are awesome viewers. Really appreciate you taking the time to watch my videos. It means a lot to me and I hope you enjoy them. So you'll take care of yourselves. If you want to see more of me, keep up another the video list or stay tuned for more. Feel free to leave a comment below. And please remember to tag the like button if you enjoyed the video. In the meantime, I'm going to go run for my life. Goodbye, everybody.